but the, but the idea that we're reading less is uh, critical to how we make good decisions for ourselves. In Here's our the thing, though. Here's the thing I found, and I've especially found it since I don't spend much time with academics anymore. You know, when I when I spend time, I spend it with uh, uh, trades folks and contractors and uh, folks who are out there doing hands-on kind of work. And here, and, and a lot of them are high school graduates, and maybe some sure. uh, uh, licensure. Listen, type. and I don't think this is a put down for any of those right. folks. He's just saying, hey, if but here's you the thing. had that skill, then yeah. Here's the point, though. A lot of those folks are the deepest thinkers I know, <laughs> and they come up with the most creative approaches. And a right. lot of times, when pundits say, "Well, I predict so and so is going to win an election," right. it's because they haven't got a clue of what the American politic, body politic actually thinks right. because they've not given time to go out and talk to the guy who, uh, you know, is doing your pest control. Well, he's a guy with a family who's earning a living, who's running a business, and probably reads a lot. And those people, uh, I found... They've been discounted. Are you saying that? And, and, yeah, and, way, right? and they're well-read. That's the, that's the thing that that's cool. I, I think... It, otherwise, publishing would have gone out of business. So it's not college graduates going to Barnes and Noble; it's everyone, right, or going right. to Amazon or whatever. And people read and they develop their own point of view. I, it just uh, as an aside. Sure, man. So I, I went to a barber shop, okay. and uh, I was uh, great conversations in barber shops. You never know what you're going to hear. But here's the thing: there was a uh, what's the word? Zeitgeist. That, okay, uh, that's there a word. There was a yes. zeitgeist there. There was a a point of view and people gravi- who gravitated toward that barbershop, women and men, right? Uh, sort of had a point of view about politics. And it was very uh, it was very free ranging okay. and it was very uh, very creatively sarcastic in a fun sort of way. All right, all right. And I think that many people who are pundits or many people in politics have no idea what's None. said in a barbershop. Not a clue. So right, when right. when they're making these pronouncements and thinking, hey, everybody's buying the, the Kool-Aid that I'm selling, <laughs> I, I think so. a lot of people are out there going, yay, yay, yay. But uh, you know, there's a, there's a you, you know, I, I think a lot of times that people forget that. And and again, it goes to yeah. who yeah. are you interested in and what are you interested in? If you're just interested in, uh, uh, you know, uh, I'm an academician and this and that kind right, of thing, and right, it's right. easy to get caught in that bubble, right?